What were some of the first things that these medical entities really wanted to know about bodies? Did they Was it anatomy or was it pathogens? Was it... Well, it falls under the whole umbrella of an atomic study. Mm-hmm. And, uh, you know, I did it. We had four, four medical students on a cadaver when I was at Tufts Medical School in Boston. And so you get together and you dissect the body in a very specific and time-consuming way that takes months, actually. Oh, wow. And you start, you know, you start with, like, the axilla, you know, <laughs> the arm, and that sort of thing. And you're tested along the way. You have to learn all these names and all that sort of stuff. And it used to be very tedious, actually, you know, for in sort of a standard of entry into the medical profession to have done that. And it's pretty grim because the bodies are fixed. So this is all for real. Like here, at the bottom of Old Red, they had big, huge vats that they would of formalin, formaldehyde, mm. to fix the bodies. And they had to sit in there for a certain amount of time to get really fixed so that they wouldn't deteriorate and rot, basically. So fixed is basically just stable, So right? So yeah. they're not going to rot away. Okay. Yeah, it's stable. It's pretty nasty because it's very, it smells, you know, and it's, a, it's kind of a caustic smelling thing. You know, when I was in high school, it has to be the same smell, I'm sure. Mm-hmm. The dissecting the frogs and yeah. things, it's mm-hmm. that smell. I could remember it now. Yeah, no, it's <laughs> the same. It's a mammalian, you know, tissue that's fixed. And then, it, and it does deteriorate and it smells more and more as you get into the months of your dissection. And then eventually you get, you do everything. You do the bones, you know, and all the little pieces are, you know, are, uh, what they do here, which is a very nice thing, is that they have a ceremony where they take all the, you know, the remains of, the people and they go out and they and they have a ceremony in the Gulf. I'm not sure whether they exactly what they do, but they have a ceremony for the people who have dedicated their bodies to science.